Mm. But then again, most of what AT and D does is shit. It's all because it's such a big, uh, big company. Nobody knows what's going on, and nobody can help you effectively. Customer service, especially. I mean, surely those people don't care. All they, all they really want is to uh, give you the momentary satisfaction of thinking you got everything, uh, got everything done, and everything is right. Uh, and then you discover that uh, the person with whom you talked on the uh, on the line, in fact, didn't know anything, and they just told you uh, they just told you what you wanted to hear in order to get a good review, because that's how they get paid. I actually don't know how the customer service people get paid, um, but my impression is uh, they are better off if you leave a good review. They call you afterwards and they ask. Well, the automated system does that, of course. Nobody does that anymore. Nobody calls you manually. That's ridiculous. Uh, so yeah, I've actually had that experience. I, I had to... I got a new phone from Sprint. Uh, and uh, I had a really good, good number. Only even numbers only something like three distinct digits. It was a good number. Easy to remember. Uh, so I wanted to carry it over to the Sprint phone. Well, no cigar. I, I had one of those pay-as-you-go phones because I, n I never used a cell phone before. Uh, well, before college. A friend was texting me all the time, so I figured I might as well get a better phone. Uh, and yeah. I called customer support, AT&T customer support. Uh, there was some information uh, missing, my account number. Uh, the phone wasn't even registered in my name, so I had to get person of the hold. Uh, the uh. Damn it, I'm stuttering. Uh, I, got, I had to get hold of the person who uh, uh, who got me the phone, but. Of course, he didn't remember because it was such a long time ago. Uh, so, in short, the person on the AT&T line, uh, he told me some easy fix, which didn't pan out, and I ended up leaving him a good review because uh, uh, they they called me uh, very soon after I talked to him, and I was under a very good impression at the time. But then I figured out that the guy was a quack and didn't know anything in reality. Uh, so that's my experience with AT&T customer service. Don't ever work for AT&T customer service because I will hate you for eternity. For everybody does. Okay, the stone is probably done. Stone. Stone. And stone. Now, put this in here. This in here and this in here. Cobblestone. This is charcoal, right? Yes, this is all charcoal, actually. Uh, let's see, do I have any more? This is coal, 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 coal. Old dicks. Nope, not like that. Um, okay, yeah, I guess I'm gonna have to uh, finish off the charcoal. I'm probably gonna end up putting it all in one, in one furnace. And that'll be the end of that. Um, I have so much coal. It's gonna take me a while to get rid of it all. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna play some more Binding of Isaac. I'm I'm on my way to getting the Polaroid. Uh, I I, I want to become better at the Binding of Isaac though. Uh, so the current goal is to one get the Polaroid, two get D6. I don't remember what you need to do to get D6. Uh, probably complete the. W I think you have to complete the womb with the blue baby. Uh, that <laughs> that probably means nothing to anyone who doesn't play in the Binding of Isaac. And the Binding of Isaac has. Uh, let's see. Two, uh, two levels, which are the basement, uh, fairly easy levels. Uh, two levels, which are called the caves. Uh, I think the names change occasionally, but that's the idea. 
uh, which are somewhat harder than two levels, um, which are the depths or necropolis or something like that. Uh, then you have two levels which are the womb, uh, in which you take uh, twice the damage per hit. Uh, let's see. After which, I need more stuff. I need more ladders. Uh, how do you make ladders? Like so? Yes, okay. Uh, in in the necropolis you take uh, in, in the womb you take uh, twice the damage uh, then let's see I can make another pickaxe and then if you finish all right so necropolis uh, the boss of necropolis is mom uh, <laughs> that probably isn't very very clear unless you've actually played the binding of Isaac either uh, I'm not going to bother explaining this, the story. Actually, I will bother explaining the story. The story goes that uh, Isaac and his mother live together, and suddenly his mother hears the voice of God that tells her to, in short, kill Isaac. And Isaac escapes to the basement, and that's the, the extent of the story. Um, what? Didn't I have 11 letters or something? Mm, I guess I didn't. I want that to be placed... To be actually, no. i just leave it like that. Uh, so yeah. Mom is the boss of uh, the Necropolis, or the Depths, or whatever that's called. Uh, then the Womb, and uh, Mom's Heart is the boss of that. At least for the first ten times you play it. Uh, after which, if you beat the Womb, you get to go either to the Cathedral, uh, or Sheol. The cathedral is kind of like heaven, Sheol is kind of like hell. Uh, is that how you pronounce it? Sheol? I have no idea. Uh, and the point is, it's hard. <laughs> um, e either beating the cathedral with certain characters gives you, uh, gives you bonuses. Actually, I think beating either a level with any character gives you a particular bonus. It unlocks a particular item that can be then found in the game. Mm, and yeah. If you beat the cathedral with uh, six different characters, uh, then you get to uh, unlock the Polaroid. Uh, the Polaroid is an item... If you're holding it... I, I don't remember what it does. I, I don't think it has any interesting... Any terribly interesting bonus, uh, but if you beat the cathedral while holding the Polaroid, uh, then you get to go to a bonus level called the chest. I've never been to the chest, so I wanna, <laughs> I, I I wanna get there. So I'm trying to beat beat the cathedral with six different characters. <clears throat> my throat is already hurting. <sighs> my sinuses hurt. My throat hurts. Everything hurts. Okay, oak wood. Is that seriously the end of my oak wood? Jungle wood, jungle wood, spruce wood. Fudge. I'm gonna run out soon. I'm definitely gonna go. I'm definitely gonna need to go back and get some more. Hmm. Yep. I hope that creeper doesn't blow up in my face. Now, I don't know if this is still present in the game, but it used to be that creepers could get you through windows. If a creeper can see you even through a window, then he can kill you. Uh, caused me a lot of problems back in the day. Uh, let's see, can I make spru uh, spruce? What am I? What, I, what am I talking about? Uh, can I make oak wood stairs? Yay! Okay. Am I blocking the mic? I think I am. Okay, and one more. How much can I recover? One! One! Okay, whatever. Uh, I have these. Mm, excuse me. And I have dirt, which is all I need. 
Hmm, damn it, excuse me. Uh, I can go up from here. Hmm. Yeah, so I've been watching Osiris Wrath. It's a pretty good game. Uh, it watches literally like an anime. Screams and all. It is kind of repetitive, though. You can uh, you can tell that all the screaming was done in advance and only in a couple of screaming sessions. It's kind of like Dragon Ball. <sighs> yep. Okay, let's see. Now, how do I want to play this? One wonders. No, not like that. Interestingly, the antagonist is also named Deus. Like me! <laughs> I broke my knees again. My knees. Okay. And I uh, put this here, 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 here. Damn it! Okay. Jump. And roof. Okay. This is actually taking shape. I'm surprised. I'm surprised. Okay. There you go. This goes down. Damn it! I broke my knees again! I think I might have dug a little too deep. That's okay, I can put in a floor and then everything's gonna be cool and dandy. Uh, this goes away. So I've been watching How I Met Your Mother recently. Uh, it's entertaining. It's, it's kind of losing its flavor, of course, because uh, <laughs> as with any series, for example, the Big Bang Theory. Uh, eventually, some luster is gonna be, be some luster is gonna be lost. I don't watch the Big Bang Theory anymore. Uh, the, the first two seasons were phenomenal, but afterwards, I get kind of bored. Okay, I can do this, and this. No, not this. I don't want to do this. Okay, just want to put a piece of wood here. And push and push. I shouldn't be wasting my wood like this. But <laughs> uh, I can always get more. Uh, plus, it's if it's for for the purpose of satisfying my obsessive compulsive disorder, then, you know, anything goes. Mm. Hey, I can I can just mine this out. My windows can go here. <sighs> I need to go get more squid. Go, go squid hunting. I should, <laughs> I should be outside right now. Uh, not not literally outside. I I am presently in Kansas and damn it no shift yes shift. I am presently in Kansas and the weather is awful. By awful I mean really really hot. I can't stand hot weather. Uh. Hey, has it has it snowed in everything? Hmm. This is an unusually long thunderstorm. Well, not thunderstorm. Just a cloudy period. Whatever it is you want to call that. I mean, I think in other biomes it's raining right now. Usually it doesn't rain this long.